Hey everyone, today I'm going to show you guys how to get 144 hertz on your monitor when your graphics card only has DP ports and your 144 hertz monitor only has a dual DVI. So I'm not going to be one of those videos, I'll just show you the answer right away and then I can talk kind of more about it. This is what you'll need. So it's very important that you see it is a dual link DVI and it is an active adapter, meaning it needs to be basically powered outside by a USB. It can't just be one cord that converts from HDMI to DP or from uh, dual DVI to DP. It needs to be one of these, an active adapter. So don't get fooled. I've seen a lot of people, main mistake, they kept buying converter cables and those aren't going to work. Those are only going to get you 60 hertz. You need one of these. Now, the brand doesn't particularly matter, but this is the one that I found on Amazon, and this one's $50, compared to every single other one was $100. So this is what I'd recommend. Okay, so for those of you that just needed an answer, there you go. But I'm going to go ahead and just kind of go a little bit more in depth. Right, I'm just going to move my chair. Okay, so here's the deal, right? I'll tell you guys kind of what happened to me. I just got an RTX 3060, not realizing it only has an HDMI and two DP ports. Well... These two 144Hz monitors, I didn't realize, only have dual DVI and an HDMI. And they just so happen that the HDMIs don't work in 144, only 60. So basically, I just had dual DVIs. So I had to figure out a way how to get the DP to dual DVI. Now, that's where this box comes in and why you need it. Now, I know a lot of you guys are going to have some funny ideas, so let me just rule out a couple of them. So this 144Hz right here is connected through a DP cable that converts into just an HDMI right there. No powered active adapter. And this one is in 60Hz and it cannot be changed and I will show you. This is the one running with the adapter and it is in 144 and I will show you. And you might be wondering, well, can't you just do HDMI to HDMI because some HDMIs can do 144? Well, like I said, a lot of these old 144Hz monitors, they can't do 144 and HDMI only on the dual DVI for some stupid reason. Okay, and just to show you guys, I will literally show it to you right here. So you can see this is monitor one right here. It is running in 144, and once again, it is using this box. So basically, what I have running out of this monitor is an actual a dual DVI right there rolling into the back of this box. And then this part, you'll have a DP cable, which you connect into your graphics card, and a USB, which will power it. And that gets you the 144. And now again, just to prove it, my second monitor, if I can click on here, which is this one, which is the exact same model. If I go here, and this is the HDMI to DP, you could see it is stuck on 60 hertz. So, once again, just to repeat it, I have not found another single way. If you get a graphics card on accident and don't realize that it's DP only, and all your monitors are somewhat old and just don't have DP ports like mine, you will need one of these. And it sucks because it's $50, but... It is the only way to get 144. I don't usually make videos like this, but um, I really wish someone would have just had a video telling me this. Forums really suck, so hopefully this helps you guys a little bit. Alright, talk to you guys later.